right, that was a tune by the Segura Brothers, two brothers from Delcom, Louisiana. And what was interesting about these guys, they were really some of the first guys to record 78s. Uh, just right after um, Alonso Lafayette was recorded in 1929. So um, there were two brothers, uh, Eddie played triangle and um, his brother Dewey was the accordion player and they both sang, I think Eddie sang most of the tunes. But it's kind of interesting sound because it was triangle and accordion, no fiddle at all. Um, but I've turned them into fiddle tunes because I love their music. So, um, yeah, Dewey was a, um, he would run whiskey. <laughs> In 1928, he was running whiskey to Port Arthur, Texas <clears throat> from Louisiana. And he read a newspaper article that they were recording Cajun music in New Orleans, that Columbia Records was recording music in uh, New Orleans. And uh, he actually happened to uh, have family that knew some of the people with Columbia Records. So he, you know, really pursued uh, Columbia and tried to get him to, uh, you know, give him a chance to record. So uh, it ended up happening and they recorded two uh, tunes. They recorded uh, Bury Me in the Corner of the Yard was one, and the one I was just playing was actually The Mosquitoes Ate My Girlfriend. A uh, slightly different version than Nathan Abshire's, but um, yeah, really interesting stuff. So uh, the one that he calls Bury Me in the Corner of the Yard is also like another tune that might be more known as Allons à la Côte Tortue, which means you know, let's go to the tail of the turtle bayou. There was a bayou around Henderson in the basin called uh, Corto Tu. So let, let's go there. Let's go fish and catch some fish. Sacale. So I'll play that one now. <laughs> the Segura Brothers. Interesting guys. And they are on uh, iTunes. Um, they're also uh, on YouTube. And I, you can Google them as well. So the two brothers are Dewey and Eddie but some of the first Cajun musicians to record from Delcom, Louisiana. So pretty interesting stuff. So. Some of the first guys to record those tunes, uh, 1929 was the year, 1929-1930. So just two interesting guys that a um, good friend of mine, shout out to Smith, who's an awesome fiddler and fantastic uh, researcher and uh, young fiddler that's interested in a lot of the real obscure stuff. So go Smith, help me, help me save Cajun fiddle. <laughs> 
So anyways, stay inspired, keep on fiddling. If you like this stuff, check out my website. I break all this stuff down. So if you're a beginner fiddler, intermediate fiddler, advanced fiddler, you'll get something out of it. Um, it's all tuned down Cajun stuff, so have your fiddle tuned down. But go check out my website. It's mitrimusiclessons.com, and you can become a member, and you can learn. There's over 200 tunes on there. You can learn everything from Creole fiddle to Cajun standards and also a lot of the obscure uh, you know, fiddle tunes like uh, Voris Connor and a lot of Dennis McGee stuff. So thank you so much for joining me today. Keep on practicing, keep on fiddling, stay inspired, and I hope to see you out there soon. Thanks so much.